Hey YouTubers, welcome back. On to test number two. We're gonna start with the control. And just to recap, we'll look at our list. We are not using HHO uh, right now for test two. We're using um, ambient air for the control and hydrogen and oxygen, so H2 and O2. And we'll get a recap of that on uh, the actual test because I accident accidentally did that one first. So here comes the control. Uh, we are at 20 PSI using just air compressor air, ambient air. Uh, we do have a magnetic field in place. I've been assured that three of these will um, be over 500 gauss. And a recap of the device. We've got 33 coils in series, 33 coils in parallel, testing for um, amperage and voltage. And you can see our oscilloscope leads hooked up right there. So, oh, there you go. That's some interference I've been having to deal with lately. I have no idea what it is. Everything in the shop is shut off. Hopefully we can get a clean shot during the test. Um, so, lead number one is testing for, uh, that's our uh, coils in parallel. This is our coils in series. So let's just wait for one second, bear with me. All right, looks calm right now. Nope. <laughs> this is terrible. So just so you know, uh, because of that interference, I'm building this uh, Faraday cage. Um, right now it's not large enough, so that box only covers um, to right here. I'm gonna go ahead and cover the whole thing and probably ground it. I don't know. I'm really annoyed. All right, so we got some clean um, lines right now. All right, releasing the valve in three, two, one. All right, no change, cutting the valve off. And just to recap, that is our background. All right, guys, on to the test. Hey YouTubers, welcome back. We're gonna do test number two now. And we're using hydrogen and oxygen. That's H2 and O2, not HHO. We're just doing uh, uh, the control and the test for hydrogen and oxygen uh, because my HHO generator is still down. So test number two calls for a magnetic field. We have three really powerful neodymium magnets in place. I've been assured this is over 500 gauss in strength. <clears throat> um, as you can see, we're still using the same PSI, 20 PSI. And I've got two parts hydrogen, one part oxygen. All right, I'm kind of glad you get to see this. This is the interference I have to deal with. Uh, I've got everything shut off here in the, in the shop except this oscilloscope and I get that interference. So we'll see what happens here. Looks like it's calm right now. All right, let's go ahead and do the test. I'm releasing the valve in three, two, one. As you can see, no change. Again, that's our background. Note we're still using the same uh, zoom level. We're at 20 millivolts on both. Uh, just for recap, this is uh, testing for amperage. This one's testing for voltage. Um, parallel and series coils. All right, so that's it. Um, I actually did the test first instead of the control, so now I'm going to do the control. 